Meet four-week-old Eve, a Brazilian tapir who was taking her first steps out into the paddock to meet visitors at Dudley Zoo. The new addition belongs to proud parents Chico and Mina. And that's Mina's fifth baby over there, so she's a very good mom. Um, we don't have to do anything, we don't have to intervene, um, but it's fantastic for the visitors to be able to see a baby animal such as Eve over there because mm. it gives us the chance to explain how they live in the wild, the reasons for the camouflage for instance. Mm. Um, it gives us a chance to ex explain and actually show life stages of animals which is really important for education. Mm. Eve was born with stripes which help camouflage them in the wild but will disappear during the next six months. Where these guys come from South America and um, they're hunted by big cats known as jaguars. So what the babies will do is complete, complete, um, keep stealing all the undergrowth and the big adults like mum here will just run straight towards water. And an interesting fact that might surprise many, tapirs instinctively know how to swim from birth. Something we witnessed within minutes of Eve's appearance in the paddock. They don't look like they'd be fantastic swimmers, do they? But they really are. And then once the babies roughly get to the age of about six months, that's when they're old enough to look after themselves and to be quick enough to be able to run away from predators. Mm. Within three months, she'll be unrecognisable. You might be able to tell she's a baby. Um, and then by the age of six months, like I said, she'll lose those spots. She'll go completely grey, just like a mum. I think the little one's lovely. Yeah. I think it's the first time he brought me. He doesn't know what to make of everything. So I've seen them on my wall. <laughs> yeah, I haven't been here for years now. About 60 years, so it's changed a bit. She's chewing on quite a lot of things now. She'll probably be chewing on some things she shouldn't be, like rocks as well. Because um, as she's teething, she'll like to roll things around her mouth. Um, mm. So that's the norm for babies also. With a successful breeding programme, many might agree there is certainly something in the water at Dudley Zoo.